Lesson 1. Nouns, kinds. Nouns are names of people, places, animals or things. Kinds of nouns. Proper nouns, common nouns, abstract nouns, concrete nouns, countable nouns, non-countable nouns, collective nouns, material nouns, compound nouns, proper nouns. A proper noun is a name which refers only to a single person, place, or thing and there is no common name for it. In written English, a proper noun always begins with capital letters. Example, Mumbai it refers to only one particular city, Steve, refers to a particular person, Australia, there is no other country named Australia, this name is fixed for only one country. Common nouns, a common noun is a name for something which is common for many things, person, or places. It encompasses a particular type of things, person, or places. Example, country, it can refer to, any country, nothing in particular, city, it can refer to any city like Melbourne, Mumbai, Toronto, etc. but nothing in particular. So, a common noun is a word that indicates a person, place, thing etc. in general and a proper noun is a specific one of those. Abstract nouns. An abstract noun is a word for something that cannot be seen but is there. It has no physical existence. Generally, it refers to ideas, qualities, and conditions. Example, truth, lies, happiness, sorrow, time, friendship, humor, patriotism etc. Concrete nouns. A concrete noun is the exact opposite of abstract noun. It refers to the things we see and have physical existence. Example, chair, table, bat, ball, water, money, sugar, etc. Countable nouns. The nouns that can be counted are called countable nouns. Countable nouns can take an article, a, an, the, Example, chair, table, bat, ball, etc. You can say one chair, two chairs, three chairs, so chairs are countable, non-countable nouns. The nouns that cannot be counted are called non-countable nouns. Example, water, sugar, oil, salt, etc. You cannot say one water, two water, three water because water is not countable. Abstract nouns and proper nouns are always non-countable nouns, but common nouns and concrete nouns can be both count and non-count nouns. Collective nouns. A collective noun is a word for a group of things, people, or animals, etc. Example, family, team, jury, cattle, etc. Collective nouns can be both plural and singular. However, Americans prefer to use collective nouns as singular, but both of the uses are correct in other parts of the world. Material nouns. These are the names of substances from which different things are made examples, sand, sugar, gold, butter, bronze, water, coal, rock, meat, egg, wood, rubber, glass, brass, milk, flour, plastic cotton, silk, iron, steel. Compound nouns. Sometimes two or three nouns appear together, or even with other parts of speech, and create idiomatic compound nouns. Idiomatic means that those nouns behave as a unit and, to a lesser or a greater degree, amount to more than the sum of their parts. Example, six-pack, five-year-old, and son-in-law snowball, mailbox. Let's remember. Fill in the noun forms of the words provided in the brackets. 1. His arrive is at 7 o'clock. Answer. Arrival. 2. The dash, hot, and humidity in this weather saps everyone's energy. Answer. Heat. 3. The dash, see, before her frightened her. Answer. Sight. 4. His dash. No. 
of physics made him the favorite of our physics teacher? Answer. Knowledge. 5. Dash. Equal. Is something. No human being should have to fight for. Answer. Equality. 6. His father took great dash. Proud. In telling people about his son's result. Answer. Pride. 7. Mr. Ran has lost a lot of dash. Way. Lately. Answer. Wait. 8. His dash present at her concert meant a lot to his daughter. Answer. Presence. 9. Dash. Live. Is precious. Do not waste it. Answer. Life. 10. Dash proud comes before fall. Answer. Pride. B. Relate the concrete nouns in the first column with the abstract nouns in the second. One has been done for you. Sugar, sweetness. Knife, sharpness. Sea, vastness. Tower, height. Snakes, fear. Wrestler, strength. Dolphins, intelligence. Snow, cold. Fire, heat. Dog, loyalty. Sea. Pick out all the countable and uncountable nouns from the sentences below. 1. The supermarket is quite close to our house. Answer. Supermarket, house. 2. How did you get paint on your clothes? Answer. Paint, clothes. 3. It is said that anger is one's worst enemy. Answer. Anger, enemy. 4. We always have shortage of water in summer. Answer. Shortage, water, summer. 5. Sufficient sleep is vital for good health. Answer. Sleep, health. 6. The park in front of our school has been closed. Answer. Park, school. 7. Various tests are used to measure people's intelligence. Answer. Tests, people, intelligence. 8. It is said that silence speaks louder than words. Answer. Silence, words. 9. The news of the Polish army's march was received with much joy. Answer. News, army, march, joy. 10. The white clouds dotted the sky. Answer. Clouds, sky. Let's revise. D. Identify the nouns in these sentences and classify them. 1. People should be more careful and stop using plastic. Answer. People, common noun plastic, material noun. 2. The army has 20 battalions. Each battalion has 50 soldiers. Answer. Army, collective noun battalions. Collective noun soldiers, common noun. 3. The legs of the table are made of iron, while the tabletop is made of wood. Answer. Legs, common noun table, common noun tabletop, common, noun iron, wood, material noun. 4. Zaza, my golden retriever, gave birth to a litter of puppies. Answer. Zaza. Proper noun golden retriever, common noun birth, abstract noun litter, collective noun puppies, common noun. 5. The white snow covered the green lawn. Answer. Snow, lawn, common noun. 6. Lionel was upset when the ball hit the goal post and went out of play. Answer. Lionel, proper noun ball, goal post, ground. Common noun. 7. I was going to watch the blockbuster movie with my friends from school when it started to rain heavily. Answer. Movie, friends, school, common noun. 8. The cotton dress very pretty but unsuitable for this weather. Answer. Dress, common noun. Weather, abstract noun. 9. Rohit grew up surrounded by a large extended family. Answer. Rohit, proper noun family, 
collective noun, then. This road leads to the stadium, that one leads to St. James's Square. Answer. Road, stadium, common noun. St. James's Square, proper noun. 11. The counterfeit bank notes were confiscated by the honest police officers. Answer. Bank notes, officers, common noun. 12. They had to cancel the examination due to the heavy rain. Answer. Examination, abstract noun. Rain, common noun. 13. The man was so scared that he did not stop running till he reached the market. Answer. Man, market, common noun. 14. There are no ghosts in this house. Answer. Ghosts, abstract noun. House, common noun. 15. It is impossible to finish the homework with so much distraction. Answer. Homework, distraction.